Heute sprechen wir über ähm, die verschiedenen Abteilungen im Kaufhaus. So, wo kaufen die Deutschen ein? Ab und zu kaufen die Deutschen ähm, im Kaufhaus ein. Zum Beispiel, was sind die Abteilungen? Es gibt verschiedene Abteilungen ähm, und es gibt so viele Abteilungen mit ähm, die äh, Bekleidung. Ja? Also wenn man Kleidung sehen oder hören, das ist Clothing. So, es gibt so verschiedene, zum Beispiel Bekleidungsabteilung, so Clothing Department. Zum Beispiel Damenbekleidung, Herrenbekleidung, Kinderbekleidung und so weiter. Es gibt auch das Wort. Um, make sure you write this word down in your notes for me to check. Moda. And moda means fashion. So write down moda equal sign fashion. Moda. So what would be some of the Abteilung. Also, go ahead and underline the word tile and write down that that means a part, like a part or a section. So if you think about the word like tile 1, tile 2, if you have like a vocab quiz, you might have part 1, part 2. Um, but tile is that part. And therefore, an Abteilung would be the part or the section, um, the department in the store. So make sure you underline the word tile and write down that that means part and make sure that you have written down moda that that equals fashion so let's dig into the different abteilungen so herren zum beispiel anzug krawatte hose jacke different types of articles or sachen things you might find in this particular department so as we go through these You'll probably want to jot them down if you are unsure of what they mean. You'll either want to look them up or I will explain some of them to you. So here we have a suit, a tie, pants, and a jacket. Für Damen zum Beispiel gibt es Bluse, Rock, Kleid. Um, pretty gender specific here in terms of some gender biases. Um, but Just to kind of help you with vocab, we have a blouse, a skirt, and a dress. Zum Beispiel für Kinder vielleicht auch Hose, Hemde, uh, T-Shirts, Kleider. So, all things for the children, but I just put two examples here. Jeans und T-Shirt. Schreibwaren is one of my favorite departments in a department store. Um, it's the... Um, department for the Schreibwaren, the writing goods. So every time you see Waren, that's for goods or wares. So the things you would use for Schreibwaren would be like the stationary section. Uh, Papier, Kuli, Bleistift, Karte, maybe a Tagebuch, a diary, a Heft, a notebook. Uh, I really like the different pens and pencils um, and markers that you can buy in German department stores. Spielwaren. So these are toys, literally the play wares or the play goods. So a Spielwaren section, you might have dolls, Puppe. Um, es gibt auch Papierpuppen, uh, paper dolls. Sometimes they also are for puppets. Brettspiel, Brettspiele. I love German board games. They make some of the best board games that are out there. A puzzle. Um, and here's just some companies. Firma. And Firma is a company. Schleich um, makes a lot of plastic figurines that are pretty realistic. Um, there's usually like a big row and display of those. Steif um, makes the beautiful stuffed animals. And... Um, They're quite popular. I, I, might, I might recommend that you look up kind of these three companies just to kind of see what they make. Uh, Ravensburger, or in America, Ravensburger. Uh, Ravensburger uh, 
They make a lot of the puzzles and board games and other games as well. Um, maybe you had some of those um, growing up here as well. Lebensmittel, groceries. So a lot of German department stores, especially in larger cities, have a grocery or a food section. Um, perhaps you've been to one um, if you're here in, in the U.S., I'm not going to go through a lot of food because you've hopefully learned a lot of different food terms. So instead, for this section, go ahead and write down three different foods that you like. You can pause if you need to and hit resume when you're ready to go. Um, sometimes close to the Schreibwaren, you might have a Bücher section. Um, obviously, there are also Buchhandlungen, uh, bookstores in Germany. But they might also sell books, newspapers, and magazines in uh, German department stores. So, Buch, Bücher, Zeitung. Zeitschrift, Zeitung is the newspaper. Right? It's the Times, if you will. <laughs> uh, Zeitschrift, it's also quite timely as well. But those are magazines, so they're not as frequent as a newspaper in general. You might find a music or video section or, or median. They might have it called a media section. So CDs, DVDs, Blu-ray, Hörspiel, a Hörspiele, uh, or Hörtext auch. Um, those are kind of like your audio books, if you will. I tend to find some good ones for children that are ones that you can listen to. Um, with a lot more things on streaming, these sections may be getting smaller in some of those stores because a lot of these are available for streaming or um, digital download. Sport. Um, oftentimes I always like to check out the sport section. So sometimes these are in the areas for the clothing and sometimes they're on the first level or second level. You kind of have to check out. You can find sports equipment often, but this is also where you can get the cool club clothes for certain teams. So the uh, trecot, uh, the trecots are the jerseys. You might want to check out and get a jersey for the national uh, Fußballmannschaft for the soccer team or like one of the other German soccer teams or football teams or basketball teams. So check out the sports section as well, especially if like there's a Euro Cup going on or a World Cup going on, you'll see a lot of people in these sections of the stores trying to get their paraphernalia. Uh, Electrogereta, these would be all your electronics. Um, a lot of things for the kitchen can be found here. Toasters and blenders as well. Um, sometimes other machinery that you might need for your home. So Haushalt, household things. Um, computer and multimedia, computer und multimedia, uh, also similar to the music and video section. So if you want to feel free to arrow up there or kind of make a connection between those two, you might have very similar items there. You also have a Schuhe section. So Schuhe would include Tennis Schuhe, Andere Schuhe. A lot of German shoe companies, Adidas, Puma, Birkenstock, those are just a few. Um, to kind of think about what you might find in a shoe section. Oftentimes on the first level as well, you might find the Schmuck or the jewelry section. So like a ring or Ohrringe, earrings, Halskette, bracelets. You would also find your armband or a watch here as well if you're interested in finding a watch. So hopefully you learned a few things about Feschina Abteilung in German department stores im Kaufhaus. Danke.